safety concerns in schools has been a big topic of discussion over the past year. Newly released documents showing a big chunk of change going to campus security upgrades. But some parents say they're worried to see this funding only go to two schools. Sasha Loftus joins us tonight with more. Denise and Brian, these documents released show a hefty price for upcoming security upgrades. But some parents we spoke with say they're concerned they're only focused on those two campuses. It is very concerning. Camilla Bywaters is worried about what's to come as a CCSD parent. Parents want to know that their children are safe. She spoke out during Thursday's regular board meeting after information on emergency security funding for schools was released. Updating our plan. Documents show scheduled upgrades at El Dorado High School will cost just over $26 million, with the majority of that money going to secure campus fencing, CCTV camera upgrades, a single entry door, and an alert system. Clark High School will see similar changes to the tune of about 100,000 bucks. Increasing safety measures for one school. CCSD calls this a life safety necessity, citing violent events like the recent attack and sexual assault on an El Dorado teacher. But speaking as a local advocate for equity, Bywaters says all Southern Nevada schools deserve the same treatment. It is important that funding is directed towards safety. That is not a question or an argument, but it also needs to be equitable across our district. So every student can feel comfortable in the classroom. How can we support all schools, ensuring that all students, all staff, all teachers have um, safe schools to um, come to? Now, CCSD documents also added that each school building has unique needs based on infrastructure and costs will vary throughout the district. We did ask for an itemized list for upgrades and expenses, but the district says they are keeping that confidential at this time. Brian.